And now our tail of the tape for this heavyweight fight. Now for the official introductions, here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, Paul Bergeron! And now he's his opponent, fighting out of the red corner, Assassin! You ready to fight? Well, as Mike Myers famously said on Saturday Night Live, if it's not Scottish, it's cop. Paul Craig back on the proving ground as we get to some early round action here. And when these bodies are dry, particularly... Oh, knee strike right to the midsection there. And he comes through with a big knee. Now goes in and secures the takedown. Trying to set up a leg submission here. Oh man, he's getting deep. Oh, submission defense on full display there. He said that he was very aware of what this guy brought to the octagon and his show in that defense. Oh, good work with the knees here by Craig. Well, that shot landed cleanly. And he's looking for that left, it's not there. Going hard to try to get the heel hook. Heel hook looks tight. Oh, no! Now trying to escape, and he does! He freed his knee, got his leg all the way to the opposite side. Now, opponent has your back, but you're in a much better position. Not there yet, but might get the submission here shortly. Back to his feet. Oh, going for the takedown here. Right now, a little separation between the two fighters. Punches and bunches as he lands another combination there. Really doing a nice job stringing the shots together. He's doing a great job of stringing the shots together and also just mixing up the target and the attacks. Great job finding different places for his strikes to land. Side control now. Craig's in half guard. Trying for a submission now. Oh, I don't know. That heel hook looks tight. Right into side control. Setting up another submission. That Darce is tight. Darce choke locked in. It's only a matter of time. But he cannot rush. He's got to control his opponent. Oh, he's out. Back to the feet now. All right, he remains in pursuit of the submission. Oh, gonna pull guard here. Flying triangle attack. I mean, he, oh, he slipped the arm out. What an escape. He slipped his arm out, and now he lives to fight another day. Oh, he's back up again. You got it like that. Caught the kick. Oh, and now the underhook, DC. He's got the underhook. He's got the far side post. If you're the opponent, you have got to get out of here. Nice job offensively as the strike lands clean. Gotta love how it's playing out between these two offensively minded fighters early. Oh! One takedown is easy to defend. When you start stringing together is when guys struggle. All right, bottom fighter here, maybe looking to hip escape, DC. Might be a submission attempt here, Chance. I mean, you cannot sit in a full guard. When you sit in the full guard, you give these guys so many opportunities. All right, rubber guard for him now, DC. We haven't seen you lean on this in the octagon. No. Oh, he's setting up an arm bar now. Ooh, looks like it might be locked in. Once he gets you going, he's got so many ways to finish arm bars. Had the submission in very tight, but as it started to slip, he went right back to the dominant position. Well, he continues to manhandle him here on the ground. Under a minute now to go on the round. Great submission defense. And he's back up. Oh, he's got hand skills for days. Beautiful combination of punches to the head. 
Craig's cut above the eye now from that strike, so we'll see how the fighter deals with that definite adversity now. Level change there, goes for the takedown. Rubber guard form now, DC. Some people believe this is nothing more than a stall tactic. Ooh, he's setting up another submission now. Oh, compromising spot here. Triangle choke is locked in. They're trying to finish the arm bar now. All he's got to do now is get his hip up into the back of the elbow to get the finish. what this fighter was able to accomplish here tonight as you can see the years of repetitions in the gym to set it up and ultimately get the tap there great technique to set up the finish all right let's take a look back at the replay as he gets it done by submission tonight champ just watch how slowly he approaches the submission though he never rushes he takes his time but it's his trickiness it's his ability to trick people into going to the floor with him that puts them in danger in finishing fights Bruce Buffer inside the octagon with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Deans called a stop to this contest at four minutes, 57 seconds of the very first round. For the winner, by submission, Assassin! All right, so what a performance by this young man here tonight as he gets the win by way of submission. He certainly put a lot of stock into getting the finish tonight, and he did just that. Congratulations. It was very tough fight, but he knew that